Hi, in this video we will review the time map uh, widget from the eCharts extension. It's the one you're seeing over here. To play with it you just can load the dashboard we are seeing right now which is the sales example. The widget works similarly to other eCharts where the label is the name of the country. The value is uh, a number which will be represented as a color in a scale which you can see over here and the series is uh, will be used to place values on this slider at the bottom which will you allow you to see different values for different times for example it's usually usually used for months or years but it can be used for some something else for example you could have a map for each category over here and it can be customized if it's the sales by country here you can customize the colors of the scale the name of the scale the low and high the minimum and maximum value and you can auto play on the on the different values of the series and you have some other uh, general settings that are common to all the e charts widgets as with all the other e chart widgets uh, the configuration for this is uh, the same as the other ones is uh, the basic template over here as i said Already val is the value for the country, label is the name of the country, and series can be anything, usually it's years or months, or it can be, as I said, the uh, um, categories of sales, to compare different levels of sales per country, per category, or something like that. So now let's go and try to replicate it. We will create a new dashboard called time map example. We will uh, use the widget e charts. We will use the sample event source and we will need a transformer and we will need the widget itself. The widget will be the time chart. We will leave this as default and connect the source to the transformer and transformer to the time map. And we will do something do something a little bit different than the, the example you saw before to generate more than one series. The val will be the amount, the label will be country name, and the series we will generate some years to to show how it works. So in list we will generate some random random years. So we will create a list with three years. This should come from your from your data source. In this case, we are generating them here. And this should be already working. You can see that the, the years are being populated here and that the, some countries are getting colors like Panama, Italy, New Zealand. And this is how the this widget works, you can move around the, the series. Whenever an update comes, it will move to, to the series when the update came. So uh, if, you, if your updates are really fast, then navigating is a little bit cumbersome. We are looking into improving this. We will see if we can release a fix for it. And if you set it to autoplay, it will move through uh, each of the years, uh, every uh, uh, interval. So this is the, um, the time map. It's really similar to other widgets on the HR extension. If you have any question, just contact us on, on, just comment on the YouTube section or contact us on Twitter, Facebook, or via email, and we 